Sony is the master of leaks. They leak a lot of shit. And, uh, I guess it, like, internal slides that they're supposed to show employees and stuff leaked, like, a few weeks ago. And it turns out there's still two million people playing PS3 online. Two million? Something like two million people signed in, huh. like, last month or something. Okay. I was one of them, because, uh, I go back on here and I get these old PS1 games that are still there. Yeah. Because these are very good versions of them. Mm-hmm. Uh, kind of like how on the Wii, like the best version of some of those games, those ROMs, or the Wii Virtual Console version. Yeah. Remember, that's the one like speedrunners like and shit like that. Yeah, yeah. Because for some reason we forgot how to do this, but um, <laughs> had Free to run. period where like you, you had the, the best version of each game was uh the re-release on modern consoles. Yeah, it, there was a, a moment free, in time. Free period. Now it just takes... It took me... I bought the PS4 and I was like, okay, they're going to let me move all my games forward, my PS1 games and shit. That's cool. No. The entire PS4 generation, no. <laughs> I had to wait till PS5. Yeah. It took me nine years before I re-downloaded a PS1 game. Yeah. It's like, oh, f- thank God. <laughs> it was Wild Arms. I had Wild Arms 1 on the PS3. That's where oh. I first played it. And I re-downloaded it onto my PS5 just to have it on there to say I did it. Yeah. Because it took nine years before you could take a game forward. And the good <sighs> thing about PS3 is you can plug it into a CRT yeah. and uh, play it like we're doing now. Yeah, you can play it classic mode. So this is actually Echo Knight on the PS3 storefront downloaded. Uh in its raw, unchanged PlayStation form. The PS1 games that are on the PS Store on PS3 are not changed at all. They're not prettied up. They're the exact same thing you remember. They run the same. That's good. (laughs) And uh, that's how we're playing this. Mm -hmm. Running in SD. Recorded in SD, so it should look okay. It should reasonably simulate the PlayStation. This is a FromSoft game. Yes. A FromSoft game I never heard about until today. You never heard about this? I don't think I heard about it. Oh. I heard about it, but uh, I never... I knew it had a boat. Oh. That's about it. Okay. <laughs> well, it does have a boat. That's confirmed. This is Echo Knight. It's 1998 to 99. Age Tech Incorporated for Yeah, Age Tech Incorporated. used to publish from soft shit. Mm-hmm. Remember that? Alright, let's see what's up. Age Tech and ASCII Entertainment. Why is the night echoing? I don't we'll know. Find out. 1937, America. Oh, you know, just America in general. I received a most peculiar letter. Henry Osmond, my father. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Look which this is built on top of Kingsfield. <laughs> I think so. We did a Kingsfield grab. Why do you say that? Oh, is he gonna yeah. We're in the we're in the home star runner of the universe. We can just pick things up with our mind. Policeman, your father was a strange man living alone in this place. There's a window missing on that house. <laughs> oh, look at, oh, oh, look at his clothes. Yeah, why is it sinewy? <laughs> why, is, why are his clothes sinewy? Reduce the contrast on the texture. I think that's what it is. I oh. think those folds aren't supposed to be that Pronounced. prevalent. Yeah. yeah. It's too uh, high contrast. You can look around all you want since you were a family. He's got some detail to his face. Yeah, you never see that from FromSoft at this time. Yeah. <laughs> the 
Okay, goodbye. See you, you policeman. <laughs> Ooh, why do I have a reticle? What? Wait, what the hell? What are the controls like? What are the controls like? I'm trying to figure it out as we speak. Okay, L1 and L2 uh, look up and down. Okay. However, I'm pressing L2 or R2 and it does this. Oh, this is weird. Yeah, they're they're in the wrong spot. Like R2, R1, and L... R, Jesus. <laughs> R1 and R2 uh, straight. And instead of L1 and R1. And, uh, the left buttons move up and down. Okay. Can you change the controls? Why? I don't know, I'm just asking. I'm not... Okay, let's see. Select, maybe? Oh, there's your old, uh... Yeah, square is your old menu. System. Key config. King's Field config. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Strafe config 1. Strafe config 2. Oh, interesting. Oh, this is weird. Now the uh the shoulder buttons turn. Like the the right shoulder buttons turn. And the left shoulder buttons turn up and down. Oh my. Oh my god. Well yeah, I was wondering cuz I in Kingsfield 4 you can change your controls around and I came up with a good system that I liked. Oh. I learned to like like this type of game where uh you um it was like a I think you move around with the D-pad. And triangle looks up and O looks down. And after a little while, I started to like it. Wait a minute, what? Look at look at the buttons on the right. They just what? change slightly. Oh, it's um That's the translation. Oh it's uh they that, didn't yeah. uh that would have um, to so do some it. different words and they had a different kerning. The way the text, uh, the length of the le letters, uh -huh. and they didn't exactly make it the same. I like, I do this, yeah, sh shit, accidentally. If that's yeah. what that is. Because look, think. like even on the controller, you can tell they're different. They're uh, all different images. Yeah, the it's a sprue on it. Yeah, look that one has sprue. Yeah, yeah, there's sprue on the on the controller. Oh my god! And man. like the banding is slightly different. It's like they they were they were all exported, um, like. Say say they had them uh, in Photoshop or something, or the equivalent, and uh, they all export they exported each one di separately, so they were all like compressed uh, slightly differently. Yeah, there's randomness in it. Yeah. Yeah, you say that, but then the tr the localization team is saying we didn't have that; we had a manual, so we took a picture of the manual <laughs> and we didn't cut we didn't cut it out right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what happened. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what happened. It's something. I don't know. It could be anything. How amazing is this God of translation? There is crazy translation stories from this time. And Shadow Tower 2 still didn't get one. Oh my God. God knows why. We do have Shadow Tower on here, by the way. Yeah. Uh, but Shadow Tower 2 is the one I like. Do you ever, uh, do you ever read about the, uh, Xenogears translation? Uh, wh in, what about the, it? The infamous. It's, a, it's a pretty good translation. But, um, it was done by one guy, and uh, it has, uh, it's just a universe of text in Xenogears. Oh, yeah, yeah. So it goes, it's long, uh -huh. it's a lot of text to read through. Of course. And he uh, he had a team, and then they all slowly quit after, like, the first few days, and it was just him left alone. Oh, really? And he was, he translated the rest of the game on the due date, and had it done with only a few mistakes. Yeah. Um... And uh, he uh, slept in the office. He never went home. He just slept at the cubicle place where he was yeah. doing it. And uh, uh -huh. he's like the sole translator for this ginormo game. Oh my god! What a hero! That is sad. And uh, it it worked. The translation is not horrible. Like it's he's a hero. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's only a few spelling problems in like I don't know like thou. It's like you're writing like five novels. Like uh -huh. together, <laughs> he somehow did it and made it fit. Ugh. It's 
broken knees. How do you know? <laughs> this is an adventure game. How do you know whether or not you're supposed to take it? This is, drives me nuts in these games. I take everything. <laughs> if I thought I was in an adventure game, I would hoard. I would just have a big bag of shit, mm-hmm. a burlap sack with every single object. I don't know when this is good for a puzzle later. <laughs> I got to yeah. take all of it. Just have a truck outside just pull, filled with boxes. You don't know if this puzzle piece, this one puzzle piece from a jigsaw puzzle might be useful. Huh. So I'm taking it. Were you mm. ever in a burnt house like this? No. You smell like shit. Oh, really? It smells really bad. It's unbearable. Oh, yeah. Like, I wouldn't well. be able to be in here, in here this long. And your clothes would inherit the burning smell. Ooh, yeah. That's you can't, not good. You can't stay in here. Like, it's not safe. Yeah. Like, if this just burned, it's getting on you. It's making your clothes smell bad. Yeah, there, there'd be shit in the air, too. Did you ever see people having, like, selling stuff that has smoke damage? Like, it says yeah. smoke damage, and it's really cheap. Yeah, that, that, you know why? like, I would never buy anything like that. You know why it's cheap? Because it would cheap? smell forever. Yeah, you cannot yeah. get rid of it. I don't know what it is, but we haven't figured out how to get rid of smoke smell. And you can't, there's nothing you can do. It's in the DNA of the object. You can't get rid of it. Even if it's a, a ceramic tile, it's going to smell like burning. I hate it. And I've been in burnt places before that just smell like crap. Especially after it rained and it turns into chiralium everywhere. Yeah, chiralium, yeah. <laughs> That's what it's like. You had one hell of a strange father. I know. Sin- sinuous policeman. Yeah, he's stranger than you. Okay, well, there's not many places to go. I guess I'll have to... Is this game, like, their idea of mist or something? Kind of like, uh, I... we're just yeah. on an adventure? Well, like, that, that might be a bit of a stretch. It's like, unless we see puzzles. Ah, there's yes, something. there's the thing. I'm, Winding key, huh? I'm, like, minorly excited for, like... The new Mist. Um, apparently, Mist Two is getting a remake, like Mist One. Yeah. So I'm a little bit psyched about that. If oh. this if this rumor is true, that's uh, neat. Riven. Yeah. Because uh, Riven is supposed to be like this. Uh, humorously hard game. It's way harder than Mist. I'm really curious about that. Okay, let's see. Did you play the original Mist yet? No. It's it's got to be on Steam. <laughs> it's, if it's not, I'm no. I have it actually. Eat my I have it clothes. somewhere. Okay, play it. Yeah, or, I do have it on Steam. I mean. Or play the original, or play Real Mist. Yeah, they're the same. Essentially. Yeah. Real Mist just lets you move around in the oh, no, 3D I, environments. I like. I'm not. I don't think I'm cut out for Mist. To okay. be perfectly honest, I uh, I got stuck immediately. Like I don't know what to do immediately. Yeah. And I don't really have the patience to keep going. So, uh, it's not my kind of game. Period. I'm sorry to say that, but it's not going to happen. But, uh, I, I very much appreciate what it, what it stands for. And, uh... what, what it stands for. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait. I like the cut of its jib, but I'm never going to play it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I love you, man, but uh, it's not gonna work. Listen, I love these ancient, obscure, uh, clunky, turn-based two D games, but I'm never gonna play them. <laughs> okay, I can't just sit here and play this horseshit. <laughs> uh, okay, I have two. I have a wind-up key, and I have uh. A regular key, but both doors open, so it's not uh, the the regular key is not relevant. Um, why would a wind up winding? Wait, I use I just use the key. Do you uh? Hell? When you read winding, do you read winding instead? The wind, oh, the winding key. Winding key. God, man, remember finding wingdings. When you were like five, 
on a computer Heracles. and being like, damn, bro, what's Wingdings? Yeah. And just using it. <laughs> yeah, Wingdings. Yeah. Is, it's kind of kind of mysterious. It's just like, it's before emojis, so it's <laughs> like, uh, you didn't know why there, there was a font that was just a bunch of images. Yeah, it was mysterious, you know. Has anybody ever written a book in Wingdings? The whole book? And you had to figure it out. <laughs> That's hilarious. Is that, is I that, hope so. I, I mean, why couldn't you learn Wingdings? It's just a one for one from the alphabet. Why would you. Why is it any different? Like, just remember <laughs> what they are and you'd get it, right? God, the controls are so weird. It's Ugh. like. God. It's X to interact, but to check something, it's clo it's triangle, <sighs> and uh, circle. I just press circle to crouch, but I don't think I think that was contextual. Hmm, an actual cutscene. That's new. Wow. Perhaps if you really wanted to waste your time, maybe uh, create Wingdings uh, translations of old games. Mm -hmm. so import Wingdings and then uh, convert them. Uh, can, uh can, can anybody write wingdings? <laughs> Is anybody people that good? Have, people have mastered the, the art of wingdings. I don't know. <laughs> just imagine somebody somewhere just having wingdings oh. a long time ago and just learning them. Oof, that guy's rough looking. Yeah. Sir, please remain seated while we pass through this tunnel. We looked in this book, and are we like, are we our dad now? Is that what's happening? Okay, um, I I, I wanted to be authentic with this, but there, there, the buttons are back to normal. What is it? Go away if you don't have want anything. What is with the sinuous clothes on people? Yeah, they're. Too bright. I'd rather flat. Like, stop trying to make it look like a cloth. <laughs> Holy shit. Jump. Right now. I can't. You hit your head on the roof. <laughs> or the ceiling, I should say. Man, oh, oh, River Hillsoft can't understand this. They don't understand what's happening. No. How do we do this? River what, Hillsoft what did you is do? just... What their mind is blown. What is this wizardry? What is this? How did he do this? Uh, is this as fast as we can go? Yeah, I'm crawling right now. <sighs> well, I kind of have to be. Like, imagine actually like walking on top of a train. I don't think you get very far. Okay, so I know what where I'm going. About? You're now. getting very far. The train's moving. Oh yeah, well. You're getting exactly as far as you were before. I mean, relative to my point of contact with the ground, oh, I'm not going very far. <laughs> Imagine somebody saying that to you in a desperate situation, and that their mind is just like, "What do you? What do you mean? We're moving fast. What are you not? <laughs> like, uh, we're both on top of the train, and you're crawling. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, uh." Why are we go why are we crawling so slow? We're not. The train's moving fast. <laughs> <laughs> no one would ever say this and unless you're Neil deGrasse Tyson, you might say it. <laughs> like, but think about th putting that aside, think about what situation would you say, um why are we crawling so slow? Why would you ever say that? I don't know. I don't know. Like even if even if say you were um you had brain damage or something, and you're like, oh, why am I crawling so slow? But then there's another lever, level of um, uh, uh, obtuseness to it with the, 
Why are we calling, crawling so slow? Why are the two of us ca crawling so slow? We're not. We're on top of a train. We're moving quite fast, actually. Bullshit! We're not on a train. We're not moving. Bullshit! That's wrong and you know it. I meant in relation to the train, not the ground. Objection! Irrelevant! Objection. That's, a, that's an elephant. Yep. Alright, it's time to jump off and just be behind the train. And let it go. Let the game <laughs> run, go. Run alongside the train. The game is now gone. <laughs> <laughs> you should be able to do that in games. Like, make it so that, uh... You can just let... When you're on a moving train, just leave it. And then go, uh... You know, go on some other adventure. Make it a branching path. Yeah, you're not I'm a villain. Go home. That's not a villain character. Have we met before? I'm sorry, I can't seem to remember you. Okay, well... I guess it is weird to walk around and talk to random people on a train. See, FromSofts is always talking about how uh, they, they like to make their character dialogue um, realistic. But they kind of go f too far sometimes, and, uh, and characters never say enough. You have to figure out, like, uh, a dude's entire backstory when he won't even talk to you. Well, we don't have to. YouTubers do. Yeah, that's true. A measured response to Dark Souls 1's lore. <laughs> 12 hours. <laughs> a measured response. That, I don't know if... That, oh, this guy's dead. Are you okay? Did you leave a crank? Uh, I love cranks. I like, I like how the term "measured response" has sort of created a, uh, um, it's sort of a meme unto itself. Yeah, yeah. Because of that one, like, I think it was he was responding to someone criticizing his criticism. Like, uh, no, no, he was defending Dark Souls Two. Someone responded to it, and he was he created a measured response to that response. I hate this. I hate it. And it was like sixteen hours long. Like, holy shit, it's not that important, dude. Like, we know why it's bad. You can just play it I for think... 15 minutes. <laughs> the problem is that uh, because of YouTube, games aren't allowed to be bad. Because oh, if I they see. come out, there's going to be a defense squad that uh -huh. are just on YouTube 24-7, making sure everybody loves this game. Dark so like, Dark Souls 2, it's just bad. And then, um... So doesn't matter because uh, if I make this 11 hour long video no one's going to watch it and then uh, if you watch it and then you disagree well I'm just going to make another 15 hour long video have fun with that one. Oh yeah well I'm going to make a 25 hour long video <laughs> yeah uh oh Why do you care about the kid? Just, just let him shoot her. It'll make things easier. Think logically, man. You'll never get the Echo Knight. <laughs> the Echo Knight belongs to me. Blam. Oh no! Oh no! See? But. I told echo, ya. But the Echo Knight. Told ya. Did you just kick his head? He kicked his head. <laughs> yes, this is a 10 out of 10. <laughs> yes, let's go. Oh, okay. I, I like the idea of kicking someone after they're dead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My, my gemstone fell out. That pendant. Oh, dang it. Do you 
like your grandfather. He's not my grandfather. I don't know who he is. <laughs> oh. oh, shit, he was lying. And that gun was a fake. Protect you from anything. Hmm. Not bullets, apparently. Okay, thanks. Echo Knight? Okay, your name is not Echo Knight, it's something. Freya. Henry Osmond. Yeah, these are Japan names. <laughs> they're Japan. They're Japan Western yeah, names. Yeah, they are. Right? Now he plays her. He can't beat uh, Adam Zadler, though. No, that's the best. Adam Zadler is number one. Raz Carsey is probably number two. <laughs> but, like, you, you can only expect the best from Riz River Hillsoft. Rizzer Hillsoft. <laughs> <laughs> and River Hillsoft's works are a direct competitor to this, obviously. Yes. Man, they got freaking rizzed up hard. Mm -hmm. Holy shit. Imagine if uh, River Hillsoft was still around. They were still competing with Capcom, and we had like a uh, like a fake DMC with the uh, made by River Hillsoft. Oh yeah. Now we beat up the child and steal the stone. Oh, okay. Lap up the blood and absorb his power. No, I guess that's not it. Can't you see? You're possessed by that stone. Yes, you can. Stone, of course. Oh, yeah. Ugh. He's got that smile. Yeah, that was a memory or something. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. Bro. Man, I guess it's true what they said about books. <laughs> it's a whole new world to explore and an adventure to go on. <laughs> yeah. The librarian was right. Uh-huh. Having fun ain't hard when you got a library card. Yeah. Take a look. It's in a book. Oh, I can pick these up. Whoa. Oh, well, that's new. Hmm. Oh, what a beautiful this painting. Is... I wonder if this was my father's work. There's a painting of two statues facing each other. I wonder what we have to do. <laughs> I wonder. Wow. I wonder if I could pick this up. The wooden chair. Yes, I can. Mm. Wow, you can actually pick stuff up. River Hillsoft is just fucking like... <laughs> they don't believe this is they, real. They don't understand. This is, uh, this They're video is real. They're not processing this, yeah. They said this video was AI. Yeah, this is, yeah. <laughs> this is AI. This isn't real. Uh -huh. You can't make a game like this. You can't pick things up. This is AI. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's exactly what River Hillsoft said in 1999. Oh, and you move slower picking up the heavier thing. Right. There you go. Oh, it changed. What? That's oh. Mario 64. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. 
Oh, you get a little bit of lore every time you solve a puzzle. That's cool. Blah, 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 blah. I like the style here. Orpheus. Uh oh, some of those, some of those, whatever they're called, the lines are, aren't attached to anything. Wait, was that voice? What are you doing here? Play this voice. Wait a minute, what? The rest of it wasn't voice. The rest of it wasn't voice. Come with me. Oh my God, are we gonna get yeah. some awesome FromSoft voice acting? Yeah. Yeah, from softer definitely west of booze. Oh yeah. <laughs> like there's no doubt. The, the, this is probably English leave. and Japanese too. Yeah. You mustn't go outside of this room. Is that understood? What's the deal with shadow people? I don't know. What's the deal with shadow people? You can't really see them. <laughs> And, uh, and you can't touch them either. So what are they good for? This is a Switch. This is a Nintendo Switch. Do you think anyone hmm. or any game ever has uttered the line Nintendo Switch? Like before the Switch. Like hmm. something just said Nintendo and then Switch was the next line. There's a slim chance. There's very slim chance. Cause like um Like uh, I know I the word Game Boy was uttered in the seventies. Yeah. In a song. <laughs> yeah, that's and, like, true. I don't know if you saw that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, st I did see that. Yeah, that's if I that's if they tell you the name of the Game Boy, <laughs> they call it riding the gravy train. Uh -huh. Like so, Game Boy was already said, right? So was Nintendo Switch said at some point? Like maybe there was a N thing where Nintendo. Um... I have this uh, box that switches between. There's a switch on it, and it can switch between uh, different uh, RF cables or composite cables. So yeah, you can yeah. Route them, uh -huh. and one of them is for the Nintendo, uh -huh. and that's the Nintendo Switch. Yeah, maybe they said that. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that that's. I never thought of that. But that that's exactly how that would have happened. GameCube was said, in reboot, warning yeah. incoming game. Uh huh. And they call it a GameCube. Like, that's pretty crazy. That's is that even rare? Even further a possibility than saying Nintendo Switch, saying GameCube. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, game. It was also purple. Games were popular at the time. <laughs> that's weird. Yeah, yeah. That, that's reboot had, reboot this TV show had purple game cubes. Hmm, I need something for that. At least ten years before the fact, like nineteen ninety, <laughs> like three or something. I don't know, uh -huh. four. Which I guess is less than ten years, but I'm getting also, messed up because I'm old. It also looked like it was on the GameCube. 